fam, I don't think you understand, son. Ghost of Shishima going multiplayer? You, you mean to tell me I get to samurai some shit up with the gang? I don't even know how to break this down, to be honest with you, family. Like, let's just, let's just see. Let's just see. I, the only reason why I'm using this inverse article is because it's just so pretty. Like, they do a good job making it very very pretty but apparently sucker punch has decided fam, that they're gonna give us what's called ghost of shishima legends oh man as you can see here is the co-op dlc you didn't know you wanted according to uh inverse now what they're saying is about this is that uh um uh, let me just see if i can find it here boom ghost of shishima is gonna be a either two or four it looks like you can team up with either you and someone else or you and three other people and they're gonna have kind of like a co-op story missions that you can do and a horde you feel what i'm saying you can fight the waves you can do the horde thing and in the future raid bosses oh i'm excited bro i'm so excited I did about this, man. Oh my gosh. I don't even know what that's going to look like, man. But let me just take a look here and see. On Monday, Sucker Punch Productions dropped a trailer and PlayStation blog post uh, detailing Ghost of Tsushima Legends due out for PS4 in fall 2020. You know when it's going to come out, fam. It's probably going to come out late October or early November. Capitalize off of that, uh, that Black Friday deal because the situation, and here's the good news, right? For those of us who have Ghost of Tsushima already, the Legends update will be free. Super popping. All you need is PS Plus, fam. But for those who uh, uh, were waiting to get Ghost of Tsushima, who I don't know who it was. I mean, hurry up and get it for the PS4. Even on the PS4, it looks great. I don't even have the PS4 Pro. And it's a beautiful game. I can't even imagine what it looks like 4K, let alone how it's going to look on the PS5. But that's not the point. Those of us who got Ghost of Tsushima already, we're set. All we got to do is wait for the update. For those who are maybe holding off until they get the PS5, it's also going to be purchase the game and it's going to come with it. Bro, I'm excited about it. And didn't they just say that they dropped the Deluxe for like an extra $10 or $11, I believe? Like, because I didn't buy the Deluxe, but now I can go spend $11 and get all the Deluxe content too? Yo, Sucker Punch is taking care of people, bro. What a lovely way to close out the PS5. PS4 saga, but uh, but let's see. Let me just see here what it says. In PS4 Fall 2020, this is a cooperative multiplayer version of Sony's latest exclusive that features new story missions, a horde mode, a four-player raid, fam, in a more fantastical setting than the realistic single-player story. Single-player story, a more fantastical setting. Have you seen the trailer? Let me pull up the trailer. Of course, they captured it on the PS4 Pro, though. Yo, I don't know what this means, fam, but it looks like it's gonna be like the, uh, kind of like how the Assassin's Creed got, you know, went a little fantasy at the end. It looks like it's gonna be like a retelling of these stories, and we're gonna be able to play the retellings, you know what I'm saying? I don't know if you played Ghost of Tsushima or not, but, uh... They have a tendency to embellish, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, when they tell the stories. So it looks like we're going to be playing the embellishments, and I'm not upset about it at all. I can't wait to dig into whatever they're going to give us uh, with this legend stuff. Bro. Oof, oof. Ah, oh, fam, the Spider-Man in? Come on, son. Come on, son. The raid bosses? I can Oh, my gosh. The undead hordes? Bro. Yeah, I'm excited. Give us a little bit of that God of War kind of... Yeah, man. Yeah, yes. Free download for Ghost of Tsushima owners. I like that part. But let's see here. What is Ghost of Tsushima Legends about? <laughs> really good up whatever so the legends isn't going to follow Jin or any of the companions from his journey but instead focuses on four warriors who have been built up as legends in stories told by the people of Tsushima so I imagine that we might we might have uh uh Gosaku or you know any of the other people with the mythic the mythic uh quests quest lines any of those is probably going to be those people as a matter of fact it looks like we got a samurai an assassin a hunter 
and a ronin which is interesting because i don't really remember any hunters i'm only in act two right now but i don't know i don't care bro i'm excited to get in here and do this man i would love to be a ronin i would love to be an assassin the samurai thing is cool and i'm not sure what the hunter is i guess they're gonna be a whole lot of uh bow and arrows man we'll see but uh, i'm excited bro and that's the least i can tell you i don't know who these people are but i know that i'm excited to play them <laughs> If you're excited, you let me know. Get in those comments below, fam. Please subscribe for more content like this. My name is Yellow Does It, and I approve this message. Peace.